Okay, so my first thoughts are that I've got a an annoyingly large wood right in front of me. So my initial intention is to move my infantry to the right and deploy them in the open ground here, supported by my cavalry. And then uh, we can use our superior firepower to deal with the uh, citizens' militia which has come out to meet us. So I'm going to group my infantry together. They're already nicely deployed in line. Uh, no, they're in the wood actually. So we'll sort of have to tempt them out of there. I don't really want to fight in the middle of a wood. It's not uh, very uh, Prussian, is it? So let's um, march my infantry over here and see uh, if that tempts them out of the wood. At the same time I shall move my cavalry into a supporting position here and I'll get my general over. Yeah. Right, off we go. Skulking around in those woods. So times like these when you can do some um, skirmishes. Never mind. I haven't uh, got that technology yet, so we have to make do without. on these um, widely spaced formations that the vanilla game does. I much prefer, prefer the tighter formations provided by um, Darth Mod and most of the other mods. It's quite unusual to see the infantry with packs on as well. Most of them want to get rid of the packs. Well, we completed that manoeuvre, but we uh, still haven't got anything to fight. Okay. We've got one unit of um, armed citizens over there, so I might as well deal with them, I think. Um, seeing as the ones in the wood don't seem very keen on fighting. So, we'll move our infantry over in this direction, and the cavalry can continue to move to the right in support.
I'm really reluctant to get involved in some sort of messy scuffle inside a wood. Oh, that's uh, got them excited over there. Alright, they're coming for us. I'll send my first regiment directly to deal with them. Or my leading regiment. It's actually the seventh regiment. Another ineffectual volley of musketry from the artillery. They're starting to fight back. What I'll do now is begin to move my other units up alongside move the 6th Regiment up onto the right. And I'd better get my general out of the way because uh, he's suffering casualties to his staff, which isn't uh, very clever. The 5th Regiment will move up on the right. On the left, rather. And then I'm going to move the 1st Regiment into a flanking position across the other side of the road with the intention of finishing the job with the bayonet if necessary. Um, well, not with the bayonet, because I don't usually use the plug bayonets. So they'll finish the job with their musket bats, if necessary. Although, to be honest, they're already shaken, so I don't think there's going to be much of a problem. Where's my cavalry gone? Oh, there it is. I'll just finish the job with the cavalry. Halt that regiment. Got the cavalry moving. Is there anybody else ready to fight? Swing the brigade round so it's facing the wood now. You can see how the formations work. If you, if you haven't used formations before, they, they do save a lot of time in battles, so it's well worth using them. Uh, just send my cavalry in to uh, finish these guys off, make sure they don't rally. It's probably a happy day now. You're never really sure until you see um, Shattered come up. You're never really sure if they're, actually, if they're going to rally or not. Okay. Well, the rest of this Polish force don't seem very keen on coming out of the wood. They're being really, uh, really reluctant. So, I don't really have much choice. I'm going to have to move in close hope that they do actually uh, come out and fight. Yeah, we'll bring the cavalry back so that they're ready. most unsporting. Time to advance, I think. See if we can actually uh, tempt them into fighting. I 
can see them falling back. They're, they're really not keen, are they? Don't blame them, really. But, uh, there's a pikeman over on the left there. They can be quite nasty if they get uh, get close enough. It's starting to rain again. Careful if uh, about sending my cavalry into this one because they've obviously put down these um, chevaux de free, which uh, aren't uh, very horse friendly. Right, has anyone got anything to shoot at? No. Let's really see if we can get in close then without going into this wood. Firing. Oh, it looks like the pikemen are coming in. slightly because I've got swords and I haven't uh, even got my bayonets fixed. I don't like fixing plug bayonets because you can't unfix them again. Which means you can't fire for the rest of the uh, battle. the end of the battle. Whew. Right, okay. Heroic victory. Didn't seem very heroic, but never mind. 